Hello, I'm John Sanders, Director of the Benefit Coordinators. We serve you, employees of the federal government. TBC is an educator of your benefits and a tool to your financial goals. Today, we have an important topic to discuss that affects all of us when it comes to retirement planning. We're going to dive into the five important facts that you need to remember about Social Security benefits. So, whether you're a federal worker or not, this information is vital to making informed decisions about your retirement. So, let's get started. First, let's understand what Social Security is. Social Security is a government program that was signed into law by President Franklin Delano Roosevelt in 1935. Its main objective is to provide economic security for retired individuals. Monthly benefit payments for those age 65 and older began in 1940. And it's important to note that Social Security is available to all American citizens, not just federal workers. To qualify for retirement benefits, individuals must earn at least 40 credits by working a maximum number of hours and paying Social Security taxes. Additionally, survivor benefits were added in 1939 and disability benefits started in 1956. Let's talk about the earnings test and how it affects your benefit amounts. You have the option to claim your Social Security retirement benefits as early as age 62, but keep in mind that the monthly amount will be less than the full benefit if you wait until your full retirement age. That's also known as FRA. Furthermore, your income is subject to the earnings test. In 2023, if your annual income from employment exceeds $21,240, or basically $1,770 per month, your Social Security benefits will be reduced by $1 for every $2 earned over this limit. Government's going to get you every single time. The benefit amount is calculated based on your 35 highest earning years. If you have less than 35 years of work, zeros are used for the missing years, significantly lowering the average and reducing your benefit amount. When should you withdraw your Social Security benefits? That's an important question to consider. Apart from age 62, you have the option to take Social Security at your full retirement age or delaying it until age 70. Taking benefits before reaching the FRA results in a reduction in the income amount, while waiting until age 70 increases the monthly benefit. It's essential to take into account factors like life expectancy and health when making this decision. While IRS life expectancy tables are not directly involved in Social Security calculations, considering your longevity and family health history is important. Also, think about the total dollar amount received if you were able to pass away at a later age after claiming a higher benefit amount. Let's discuss how Social Security works for federal workers as it forms one of the pillars of the Federal Employee Retirement System Plan. However, older civil servant retirement system retirees do not pay into Social Security or necessarily receive retirement benefits under normal circumstances, there are certain exceptions for CSRS offset, transfers, or CSRS employees who receive Social Security credits from outside employment. However, they need to be aware of the Windfall Elimination Provision, or WEP, which reduces the benefit amounts. Transfers and CSRS employees who paid into Social Security through non-federal employment may also see a reduction in Social Security survivorship benefits claimed by their spouse after the employee's passing. This reduction is known as the Government Pension Offset. On the other hand, 
FERS workers who retire before 62 under normal requirements are eligible for the Special Retirement Supplement, or SRS, which is paid from FERS and acts as a supplement to Social Security benefits before reaching age 62. It's important to note that the SRS may be subject to an earnings test and does not receive cost of living adjustments. Lastly, let's talk about cost of living adjustments and Medicare B. Similar to FERS and CSRS annuities, Social Security benefits receive COLAs as in years with positive inflation based upon the consumer price index for urban wage earners and clerical workers. So, in 2023, Social Security received an 8.7% COLA, the largest adjustment since the 1980s. However, it's important to note that Medicare B premiums are deducted from your Social Security on a monthly basis. Increases in Medicare B premiums can sometimes offset the benefits gained from a COLA. Go figure. For example, in 2022, there was a 5.9% COLA, but Medicare B premiums rose by 14.77%, resulting in a net decrease in the benefit amount affected Social Security by Social Security recipients, and the affected amount was a negative 8.87%. Fortunately, in 2023, the COLA was 8.7% and Medicare B premiums actually dropped by negative 3%, effectively compensating for the adjustments made in the previous year. So, to recap the five important facts about Social Security benefits, number one, Understand what Social Security is and how it provides economic security for retirees. Two, be aware of the earnings test and how it can impact your benefit amount based on your income. Three, when to withdraw your benefits, weighing factors like full retirement age and life expectancy. Four, for federal workers, know about special provisions like the WEP, the Government Pension Offset, and the Special Retirement Supplement. Five, keep in mind cost of living adjustments and the impact of Medicare B premiums on your Social Security. And there you have it. These five important facts will help you make informed decisions about your Social Security benefits and optimize your retirement planning. Remember, understanding your Social Security is vital to securing your financial future. I thank you for watching. TBC has created a handbook. It's available to help you understand the complexities of your benefits. It's available on Amazon, or you can contact us. If this video has helped you, please press the Like button. Subscribing will help us, and pressing the chime will notify you of our new posts. I thank you for your service.